welcome aboard one of the most high-tech and my waypoint just puts me like right now right there ontario freeway firefighting tools again with two major fires raging right now in the world based here in california coming across the head now the downwind portion of the fire this is intel 12 part of the Firus program Firus, which stands for Fire Integrated Real-Time Intelligence System. That's the official acronym for this state-of-the-art infrared and high-definition aerial camera system. I'm going to switch to IR. There's still quite a lot of heat. Yes, 100%. It's a game changer. Here's the way it works. An incident is spotted and reported. For this example, we'll use a small possible wildfire in San Bernardino County. Intel 12, a King Air, takes off from Chino with a crew of three. Within minutes, Intel 12's FLIR sensor high-definition infrared cameras are sending video back to the Firus Fusion Center, which is based at the Los Angeles City Fire Department. That video is analyzed and forwarded to the University of California San Diego's supercomputer, where within seconds a model is generated and then sent back to the Fusion Center, showing the potential for fire growth over the next several hours. This potential growth model is then sent across the state and based on the projections, the necessary resources, firefighters and equipment are dispatched to stop the spread. The vision came from Chief Fennessy from Orange County Fire Authority. The need has always been real-time intelligence. It's gotta be fast, it's gotta be simple. Even on a smartphone in the heat of battle, me having to you know, enter a user ID and a password, I'm not gonna do it. I don't have the time. I need to be able to touch it and it needs to be there. We're estimating the area of origin to be just off. It's been an interesting project. Um, you know, started with proof of concept and has evolved into really a program that, you know, I believe and many other fire chiefs and, and I would even offer up the director of Cal OS sees as a we got to have program. It has to be here when we most need it. It's been a phenomenal partnership with the Orange County Fire Authority, with our partners in Southern California fire agencies, LA County and LA City and, 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 and several others. And now uh, we are um, uh, bringing this on to uh, uh, OES as a mutual aid asset to make it available to all of California. Forward spread has been stopped. The relationship that local government has with Cal OES really lends itself to this type of, of innovative thinking. There's a pretty good shot. Primarily used for wildfires, this aerial intelligence has also recently been used to provide the first images of an oil spill along the coast. We're over the uh, oil spill off of Huntington Beach. In Orange and a multi-car train derailment in the Mojave Desert. We count 16 cars in here. There may be more uh, underneath. The train derailments allowed a aircraft from 13,000 feet to get all the way down to determine what product was in each one of the, the tanks or in, in, the, in the rail cars, which rail car had been derailed, which ones were impacted. We are really don't even know the limits of this program at this point. We've used it and experimented with search and rescue in the snow. Does it have the capability to be able to find footprints in the snow? As you can see, there's a, an increase of activity there with lots of ember uh, showers. One of the main reasons why it does and the cohesion that you see is because we're all committed to the mission. The mission is to save lives and property. I believe by you know, Orange County Fire Authority taking a proof of concept, developing that to a point for it to be a legitimate um, and valuable state program and handing it off to Cal OES, who is, let's face it, the state's all-hazard um, agency, just makes great sense. This collaborative effort between Cal OES uh, and Cal Fire brings this asset into the uh, state mutual aid system and allows it to be more uh, readily available between the two agencies to send it north, south, east, or west. As we roll out this fire's capability, our partnership with Cal Fire will be essential in our ability to extinguish wildfires rapidly, uh, but as well, all other hazards that we see in the state of California. Uh, its ability to keep firefighters safe, to rapidly identify fire spread, uh, to be able to protect lives and property, and deploy resources will be essential in our ability to effectively respond to events that are impacting the state. To see more videos from Cal OES, follow us on our social media platforms or go to news.caloes.ca.gov. For all of us at Cal OES, I'm Brian May.